cancer. It's a very scary word. But an outstanding treatment facility was here at home. I was led to the Lawson Cancer Center. As a nurse practitioner at the Lawson Cancer Center, we are champions for our patients. I am so happy for Robert. The treatment worked. Make it through the day. On Tuesday, May 2nd, Pikeville Medical Center hosted their Stroke Awareness Day event at the Appalachian Wireless Arena. This is the first time the event has taken place since 2019 and many showed up to receive free screenings and learn about stroke risks. Pikeville Medical Center is dedicated to not only informing, but helping those who need it. Yeah, so here at uh, Pikeville Medical Center, we're putting on this Stroke Awareness Day to do th just that, to bring awareness to the community about stroke. So stroke obviously is very important here. Uh, we do a great job. We have a multidisciplinary team here at Pikeville Medical Center, and we're going to have a lot of those people included here at today's event to talk about things like risk factors, things that we can do as far as treatment, uh, the protocols that we have in place at Pikeville Medical Center that really to provide the best care that's possible here right here in the mountains. For strokes, there are modifiable and non-modifiable risks. Adjusting certain lifestyle choices can drastically improve one's health. Obviously, we want, it starts with your primary care provider. So we want patients to take an active role in their health, discuss with their primary care provider about modifying those risk factors. Again, hypertension, hyperlipidemia, diabetes and smoking, but those are the other factors that patients can really take an active role in. So modifiable risk factors such as lifestyle modifications are very important. So we encourage our patients to be as active as they can, be active during the week, get out, get outside. We live in a beautiful area. Take advantage of that. Get outside and do these things and be active. Uh, obviously, dietary modifications are something that we always talk about as well. And so again, it's not only about what your provider can do for you, it's what, what can you do for yourself. And so we want to try to have patients take ownership in regards to being healthy. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.